Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm uh, going to demo today's workout, which is our upper body movements today. So, a little bit different today. Um, shorter work period, but we're looking for a bit more intensity. Um, so, we're going to go 30 seconds on in, one, in our push-ups, then it's a 30 second reverse plank. I'll go through the reverse plank. Um, for the reverse plank, you can use a bench or you can use two chairs. Um, two chairs makes it a lot harder. I've just been playing around with it. It is a much harder movement. Um, you can use a bench, but you won't. When you do it, you really gotta make sure you push hard into the bench with your elbows. Um, so we're gonna go directly into those. Again, I'll post in the comments below, somewhere down here, um, the, the actual workout that I've written up. So we'll do that. We're gonna do four sets today for that one. And then we're gonna finish with a bit of an arm burner for, for everyone, just to, um, just something a little bit different, makes it a bit more fun for everyone. And everyone likes to have nice looking arms. So um, we're gonna do towel curls and extensions two sets and then we're going to do a max rep set for our last set so our third set we'll do max reps um, of both exercises now these are going to be super sets so we want to drop it straight into the next one so you'll do your curls then your extensions straight away so you get lots of blood pumped into those arms and they look nice and big get some um, shirts ripped and stuff like that all right um warm up today you're just going to need a broomstick i'll go through the workout um, a lot of it is shoulder mobility stuff, which again, everyone's stuck in this position. So we want to make sure we're opening up, getting up nice and straight. And we're going to get those shoulders. If your shoulders are hunched in and curled in, we're going to try and open that up so you can sit up a bit straighter and get, get those upper back muscles working and just make your shoulders a bit moving a bit freely. So you should be able to get into that position pretty comfortably. Um, if you struggle to get your hands directly overhead, they sort of get to here, and it feels a bit tough, you probably need to get stuck into some of those, um, some soft tissue and release areas. So grab yourself a massage ball and get stuck into it, or a foam roller. Um, anyway, let's get into this. So, broomstick, I'm gonna take the head off. If, you got, if you've got other stuff you can use, you can use a band, or you can use um, a skipping rope or something, but we're gonna do pass-throughs and we wanna do uh, 10 reps, 10 reps, yeah. Just going all the way over and then coming all the way back. So if I stand side on, all the way back, not allowing my back to arch, all right, keep those abs tight. We're gonna get our shoulders doing all the work, making sure everything loosens off. Get that blood flowing. Then from there, we're going to do a bit of a shoulder stretch. So I like this one. So you grab your, your broomstick, you put it so it sits behind your shoulder, and you reach around. So you're reaching on that same side. You turn your elbow out, so my elbow turns right out to the side, and then I'm going to lift. So I get a really good stretch in through that shoulder. Now, I don't want it to come across. I want to make sure that I... I'm staying straight and I'm lifting straight up. It's a really good one just to help open up that shoulder and get a really good sense of mobility and stretch. Um, I feel it a lot into my neck, but it is great for your shoulder. Just working on that external rotation a bit. All right, we'll do the other side. So same thing, same deal. Goes behind this shoulder and then I'll reach in front and grab it and lift, again, so I get that really good stretch. Not hyperextending, keep those abs engaged, gently lifting up. Get that really good stretch through the shoulders. Hold that for about 30 seconds. Then we're gonna go into our front delt stretch. Now this one, a um, little bit different. What we're going to do is we're going to put our broomstick behind our opposite shoulder. So if I stand front on, you guys can see I'm reaching across my head. I put it behind my shoulder. I'm going to rest, rest the back of this hand on and then 
gently leaning forward and getting that stretch. So I'm not going over my head, I'm coming down on that same side, getting that really good stretch through the shoulder. Just stretching out through those shoulder positions. Maybe move your head around a bit, play around with those positions, loosen everything off. We'll do the same on the other side. I'll demo again, so we're going over. So we put it behind our shoulder, rest the hand on, and gently pull it up. Now you might find one side is tighter than the other, and that's okay. Now when we're doing this one, we don't want to hunch forward. We want to stay up straight and then lean into it. Same thing. There's no point just trying to make it go higher by adjusting. Just gently pull down and get that stretch into the shoulder. And down. Cool. All right. So depending on how sore you are or how tight your shoulders are, you might like to go through that one or two times. Um, my shoulders feel pretty good, so I won't be doing that anymore. Um, we're going to get into the workout. So the workout works. You're going to go 30 seconds, max push-ups. Now, we want proper push-ups, so arms extending all the way out, abs tight, chest hitting the floor. Now, if you struggle with that, you can do them off the bench or something where we're pushing, but we're still making sure that our arms are getting nice and long and getting our triceps. We're not dipping into our shoulders and pushing through. Keep shoulder blades pulled down, elbows in, push straight back out. So straight down, we'll go for 30 seconds. I'm not going to go for 30 seconds because I can't see the clock. So but chest and floor, lock out every single rep. I'll demo on the angle a bit. So from here, gently down, straight back up. All right. Again, I always try and think of it like I'm trying to push push a car, um, I wouldn't push from out here, I want to get in behind it, get in nice and tight and then like really drive through it. Um, then we're going to go from there straight into our reverse plank. So our reverse plank, we're going to put our arms on the chairs and our feet on another stool or step. How are you Emil? Um, we're going to go into our reverse plank. So. From here, we put our feet up, hands down, my hips are here. I saw this one from Joe DeFranco the other day, so shout out to him. And up and hold. We want to hold that. Try and hold that for 30 seconds. Um, really push down. If you're using a bench, I'll demo with the bench. It is a bit easier because you just have that bit of extra support. So here's the bench. We're going to get up. We're going to lift our hips and we're going to push our elbows down hard into the, into the bench. So we're getting those upper back muscles working as well. We really need to make sure they're active. So driving those elbows hard into the bench. All right, so four sets for that one, probably rest about two minutes in between. And then, how are you, Tasty? Uh, then we're gonna go into our arm workout for today. So, for our arm workout, I'm gonna move you guys so you can see. Do, do, we'll go. Up here, just got to move some stuff. Bam. All right, here we go. So, for our arm workout today, oop, here I am. Arm workout today, we're going to go biceps straight into triceps just so we get a really good work. Um, 15 reps, again, I'm using the towel just here, just coming straight up. 
keep those shoulder blades pulled down and back. It's just the elbows that are moving. It should be any other part of our body. All right, working really, really hard. Squeezing those triceps. No, biceps, sorry. Ha! I've been doing this for 10 years and I still get it wrong. All right, then from here, we're gonna go into our triceps. So straight into it. So down here, and just extending the elbows out. Again, we're looking for those 15 reps. All right, and we're gonna do two, two sets of that. And then on the third set, you're gonna do a max rep. So you're just gonna keep pumping out till you can't do any more. And then you wanna jump over and do as many tricep extensions as you can. All right, that's it for today, ladies and gentlemen. Hello, mum, I hope you're doing well. Um, I will see you guys tomorrow. Enjoy. Till then.